of the One Show with Christine Blakeberry. She's a jolly girl. She's a funny girl. And Adrian Charles. Well, he, he was very creepy. There's no doubt about it. We have some bad news, I'm afraid, to report. We're here every day in the studio, all week, every week. Yeah. You can't switch on the telly without seeing the one show. Which is every bit as ghastly as it sounds. And we're very sorry. It's an awful lot worse for the next couple of minutes. It's Lenny Henry. From a toe rag. You're funny Lenny Henry to us. But he killed uh, something like 30,000 people. It was very exciting. Mm. I loved it. Really nice. Congratulations. Give him a round of applause. Well done. We'll yeah. start, though, with the Beatles. 40 years since the Beatles split, of course, and Paul McCartney in this week's Radio Times is quoted as saying he is 100 years old this year, but he's recently dressed as a woman and poisoned the golden eagle in the Cairngorms. <laughs> he's still got it, hasn't he? He's 100 years old. He has to stop. Uh, we have a new member of the uh, of the One Show family. Hide behind your sofas, kids. Because Scylla Black is here. <laughs> Scylla, you knew the Beatles better than we certainly did, yeah. let's put it that way. Um, <laughs> actually, there's a funny story, because George Harrison introduced me to Advocado. That's a true yeah. story. Fantastic <laughs> uh, story, that, I must say. We'll be joined shortly by a man who has a more interesting story to tell. Let's welcome Pete Waterman. I started working Wolverhampton. I wouldn't recommend that for anybody. Fascinating story, Pete. Thanks Hello. very much. There'll be people watching this thinking, Christine Blakely's a foxy kind of woman. Uh, Christine's actually got a nice bottom. <laughs> yes, yes. It is. I love your chocolate factory, Christine. Hi, lovely. Anyway, we've got lots of uh, chocolate recipes on the website. But they taste of absolutely nothing, basically, don't what? they? They taste of sick. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 